it's caught in the crossfire. It's caught in the So hi, well, I, that's that's exactly what I was about to do. Oh, okay. Baby. That's exactly what I was about to do. Oh. Because this doesn't mean that I am coming back to do videos, okay? Yeah, it does. But no, it doesn't. Uh huh. Oh yes, it does. It 1000% means that you're coming back. You would never leave if your life depended on it. I mean, do you want to do this video? <laughs> do you want to do my video? Uh, you're being Mika and I'm being Joe, ain't I? At, well, at this point, when I'm a giant billboard for Jesus, so everything is all right. Everything is all right. It's backward, but it's Jesus saves. I don't know why the camera is backwards. Because I'm pretty sure on the stream it comes out backwards. It's like, what the flip? So lots of people coming in. Thank you. It's like a mirror, man. Yeah, I don't know why it does that though. Like, I, there should be a setting to. F Maybe it's in the settings. It's a reflection thing. Yeah, I get it. It's some apps are like that, but most apps flip it automatically for you, so it's not backwards. I don't get. Well, it's probably the phone. Well, well, why don't you like after the stream? Yeah. Like, fidget with it. And maybe you two should learn how cameras work because this is how they work. Well, if you can fix it. That's right. Finally, fasting for life. He does say. Yes, he does. Amen. And and this will be a preaching video after I get done with my my intro. God loves us. God loves us. Oh, a preaching video. Just what we all came here for, listening to you preach. <laughs> preach, preach it. You got your Bible, I got my Bible. Mm -hmm. We're solid in that. We've been talking about going to Israel yep. during the time of turmoil. Yeah. I How are you going to do that? How are you two going to go to Israel? First of all, you might want to figure that out. Second of all, how the hell would you get Shani to Israel? Even if that was even a possibility, which it's not. I love this shirt, Finally Fasting. Hello, nice to see you again. Thank you, bling and things. You're always nice. I want... Go ahead. I got Christ on my right thumb. Yeah, you do. I want to have something similar, too. That's cool. And I, want, I think I want it right on the same spot. Cool. Yeah, because my left hand is going to be the wedding band tattoo on my wedding finger, definitely. Whip. Yeah, definitely get that ring finger wedding tattoo because you guys are going to be together forever. <laughs> I can tell. With with S E E on it, Shannon Eileen Negro. Bathing my kids, getting ready for work tomorrow. Keep your head up. You can make it happen, I believe. Well, thank you. See, I need to see stuff like that. If I saw more stuff like that, I'd keep streaming and stream more and stream more because it's like it's it's healing. It's therapeutic to get positive comments, and that's wonderful. Oh, Jason, you don't get nice comments because you're a child abusing, lying, grifting, scamming POS and not many people like you or your girlfriend. But I'll tell you the truth. The reason I left is because of the negative comments. They do get to me. Some of the things I see on there, it just makes me think in a bad way. And it's bad for me mentally. And my therapist would tell me, don't flip and do it. But why would we listen to a therapist who's telling us that it's bad for our mental health to read the nasty comments, so stay offline, so where are we? Online. It's not good for you. Don't read the trolls. Well, it's hard because you get reminders, and I, I even had my reminders shut off. But then you go to your Instagram and you click the heart and see what's happened, and then you see the comments. Inevitably, you're going to see the comments of people that aren't blocked yet, and then you block them. But it's tra every time, it's fucking trauma, trauma, trauma. You can't talk about your private life. We don't. We don't anymore. I mean, we give general details in vlogs sometimes, but but we never get that personal about our personal life. It's trolls on their channels that talk about us, and then other people think it's great to talk about us. It's true. You need seven positive comments for each negative. That's true. Yeah, I agree. Bling and things. It it really does get to you psychologically because you see them, because you know Instagram can't uh, uh, autonomously ban these type of things. You, the, the AI might get really good and, and just automatically ban people that comment like that. I, that's a great future. I would stream then. If the AI gets that good and starts kicking assholes out, out of comments and blocking them automatically, I, awesome. I'm for that. Anything that's untoward or hateful. Why do you have to be hateful? People know what to say to get to you. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I admit that. Who's requesting it? Let's see. Katana Joy. I, I mean, I don't know you. Like, I've seen you a couple times, but I'm not sure. Uh... Maybe I have to just do my own thing for a while. And I, I because I'm, I am a YouTuber at heart and I liked doing videos the way I did them. The live streaming thing is a little different. And I don't know. I think it will be that way eventually. I hope so, Miss Fribbit. I hope so. Carrie's using you as content. Wow. Yeah, I'm sure you she tell is. us every single time we're online. What kind of psycho? Does she have nothing to do? I know. She's got to remind everyone that she's around. No, but serious. Serious. I'm serious. Does she have any kind of fucking actual life? You're going to ask if someone else has nothing better to do with their time or some kind of life when what do you two do? This? Okay. I don't know. 
she she st she stays at her fucking Instagram on and just oh my god okay right into the computer room and do the are you crazy? Emotionally responsive people are vulnerable when something they're passionate about gets shit on. I speak as one myself. Yeah, I know I know what you're saying. Um, C said dot K C. I'm sorry. Well, what what would you want me to call you? C C said C felt C. <laughs> no, Carrie is very mean, very pretty. Yeah, I well, I'm glad you feel that way. I think she is. No, she has no life. Thank you, Miss Shanner TV. Rev, you, you you enjoy making videos. Why not record them and not live stream? I might. That see, that's really good idea, Miss Rivik. But going back to what I used to do, and I was that's where my mindset was. That I with the video apologizing for being an asshole and shit. You like, know what's awesome? What? I get a sneak peek of your videos. Well, yeah, that's true. If yeah. I if I had to do some editing and stuff, yeah. Yes, Shani is a fan of Rev. I've always have been. You like my videos, yeah? Yeah, he helped get me saved through that, his videos. Well, that's Jesus Christ did that. But yeah, thank you. You're welcome, baby. Jesus Christ did it. You were in the right place, right time, and he loved you. He always loved you, though, and you always loved him. When you were an atheist, you loved Jesus. Yeah, because he's a renegade. He's a renegade, yeah. I think... Oh, so she was an atheist, but she still loved Jesus Christ. That... <laughs> make that make sense. You do not... You and Shani need to go live and talk about crime and everything you want to talk about. Yeah, I, I, we, I would love to do that. We should start using the crime and games. Yeah. Because we got subs already. They were really responsive. We'll just do it, like like I said, a Kicks exclusive. Kick? Yeah. That's where you can live stream is on Kick, like really good. Okay, yeah. Here you only get an hour. Well, no, we but but we have a YouTube and a Twitch, right? We made a Twitch. Yeah, stream. but our YouTube's gonna be gone because they're morons. Well, yeah, the YouTube would be gone, but but Twitch. I thought we were gonna do it on Twitch. That's what I thought. The main one. Oh my God, what is with that neck thing? And who the hell cares about this conversation? We we, we could try. I hope we don't get banned. We're not. I don't think we'll get banned. All right. We'll just never ever ever do an overnight stream again. Yeah. That was. Dumb, stupid, irresponsible. But but yeah, I, I I also like I came back. So th the main reason I came back is that I wanted I wanted to do a goodbye video, really, because it's not it's not nice to just put a graphic up and say, oh, I'm not doing videos anymore. That's kind of bogus. There's Gavin Kit Kats. Hey, Gavs. He's a good boy. He's gonna lay down on the blanket. Being able to edit them might help you, so the response trolls want from you won't be available to. Yeah, that will that see. I don't know what the type of stuff I would have got if I live streamed with my old channel. I don't know. I think it would have been a lot of loving Christian people because that's mostly who my audience was. You know what's really good? Yeah. Chantel and Salah's couple mm -hmm. channel. Yeah. That is really good. You should see their, when they went to Thailand. They got such great footage of Thailand. It's absolutely uh, stunning yeah, in it, Thailand. It's like going there, so you should see it. Yeah. I want... Shannon, crawl the hell out of Chantel's behind, please. It's really pathetic. You to be happy. Don't feed the trolls. Ignore them. Yeah. I hear you. I was told by my therapist since I'm empty nesting that oh is that what we're calling it now empty nesting aka my kids got taken by CPS and was put in foster care permanently that's not empty nesting you dumb cow empty nesting is when your kids grow up and go off into the world by themselves and you're left alone without your children because they're off living their lives or going to college or, or, or getting into a career that's empty nesting you dumb cow not what you're dealing with you lost your kids because you couldn't take care of them bet on that give me a break empty nesting you, is that a nice cute word for lost my kids to cps um i really need to discover myself <laughs> And I have a job over the three weeks to try to, you know, find who I am. Oh, Shannon, there's plenty of us who can tell you who you are and what kind of person you are. Plenty. Blingen, and, Blingen thinks that I don't, I don't know why people can't leave each other alone and it's sad and ridiculous. Yeah, getting in your... Chantal is an animal abuser, though. No, she's not. You always bring stupid fucking stuff up. Anyway, I like finally fasting. Leave her life. alone. Stop talking shit about her. Grow the fuck up. You always put labels on people that are unrealistic, and but the people who don't really know who we are, we get we get the whole, sh you know, we're abusive too, and we're not. I know. Oh, you're not abusive? So you're not abusive to Jason, and Jason wasn't abusive to your child? Sounds pretty like a pretty abusive home to me. Last I checked, that doesn't go on in healthy, happy homes. You are both 1,000% abusive people. Yeah, we had problems, like every other human being. No, we all don't have problems like that. I have problems. I have made a lot of mistakes in my life, but I've never had the problems that you two seem to have because I don't hit children. But we're actually managing and fixing our problems. Thanks, Miss Fribbit, you too. Uh, 
anyway, I thought it was extremely ignorant to, to just leave a graphic and say I'm done. So that's why I'm coming back. And I don't know if, if, if I can, if I can really get into a mental state where that stuff doesn't bother me, then I'll no longer, I, 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 I can just come back and do what I used to do. Yeah, man. It'll be awesome. I love what you used to do. It was so, there was a lot was of, enlightening. yeah, but there was a lot of downloads that were happening then with the Holy Spirit. And, and yeah. I don't, I don't, I haven't had that type of communication. Before. Until recently you started sort of. getting back into yeah, it. Yeah, that's true. Well, how you doing, Stacey Lockwood? Uh, I might, I might make this a separate video of the preaching. Oh. Please, God, save us from the preaching, because the last thing I want to do right now is listen to you preach about anything. It might be a separate video. Okay. Because I'm feeling like I, I'm, I could go maybe an hour just on the preaching. Bro, I'm here for you. All major YouTubers have trolls. You just have to ignore them. Carrie's making her name use as content. Carrie's a fucking sad person. Thank you, Katana Joy. So... Oh, Carrie's a sad person for outing all of your bullshit? I don't think Carrie's a sad person at all. I think you two are just salty because she got y'all good. Sorry. I was going to... I grabbed my Bible because I felt like I, there was going to be some preaching happening. And I opened a Matthew 24 on the button. Literally, it just fell open to the rapture verse, actually, in Matthew 24. That, that I'll just read the verse to you quick, and that might be a preview of what, okay, it's Matthew 24, 31. And he shall send his angels with the great sound of a trumpet, and they shall gather together his elect from the four winds and from one end of heaven to the other. That's the harpazo, rapture. The, na the, the word rapture has been abused, and it probably should be replaced at this point with harpazo or gathering, or just the great gathering together, okay? Because what rapture means is being violently snatched up, specifically, because raptura, rape, it's weird. Okay, because our modern concept of that word is like, well, holy shit, it's horrible. But it just means violently snatching away. Quick, in the twinkling of an eye. Okay, the gathering together. That is proof that that is going to happen, and that has not happened in history. The last Trump is in Jewish theology. Um, it's in Islam. It's also in Islam. Okay, that it's the resurrection. That's the it's the blessed hope. Okay, when you hear blessed hope, it's it's the resurrection of the dead. That's the event. Everybody in history will be resurrected at the end and judged. Amen. Okay, at the white throne judgment. If you know Jesus Christ, you're good. And that's that's what we see. Or what I call my redemption day. Most most YouTubers don't read the comments. No, I don't think it's going to be your redemption day, but I think it's going to be very, very hot where you're going. That's right, Miss Shanner TV, especially the big successful ones. Uh, Cinnamon Toast Ken said, I absolutely never read comments anymore. When he was a smaller channel, he did. When he's, he's huge now, he doesn't read any comments. He doesn't give a fuck because he's just making money on views. That's it. It's what matters. Okay, so he can keep married. Damn right. So, Mary's gorgeous. Mary, Mary's really gorgeous, yeah. And so, PewDiePie's and Marcia's little baby in the pumpkin. Just look up PewDiePie's uh, Instagram. You will see him and Marcia and the baby in a pumpkin suit. It's so cute. It's so beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. They are one of the most beautiful families I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh, are they the most one of the most beautiful families you've ever seen? Yeah, they're real parents. Life. There's no doubt. Uh, Yoshi. Yep. Here you go. We miss you. Yoshi. We miss the Yoshi. I don't know if she has an Instagram. She's a good moderator. She probably, yeah, she is a good mod. I don't. She probably has Instagram jewels. Probably. I hope she. Yeah, she probably does. Okay, I could I, like follow her or whatever, and then she'd be like, "Oh, okay, you're here," and then follow us, and then she'll be here. I don't know. So. She kind of has a little crush on you. I, I, I don't think so. I think. I, I don't think so either. I don't think too many people have a crush on Jason. I'm sorry. So? She just has fun. She's just cool. She's like when, I've known girls like her. Okay. That's the vibe I got from her. I, it was only a couple weeks. We were friendly and nice, and it was great. It was, she's cool, you know? Kind of remind me of Tara a little bit. She's got she to she take the freaking Well, it's, trolls, yeah, yeah, you yeah. know. But but she's been nice, though. Yeah. Recently, she's been nice, So, it, but whatever. The point is, is uh, I kind of need a setup. And on, on the Amazon wish list, I got a couple things, just a microphone and, and a, a cheap laptop. And I'm praying somebody, you know, can help me out with that because it's kind of hard unbelievable this is gonna infuriate me you expect people to buy you a mic and a computer are you serious like the only device that we use for everything is is this alienware laptop we got and that's all we got really we have tablets but tablets are limited they're they're fine and phones are okay too but i for me to record something and and really like do the editing and shit you need like a setup so I'm you had a setup. You had the best of everything. You left it all in Colorado because you couldn't pay your rent and you got kicked out. So now you want us to replace what you left behind in Colorado because you were too irresponsible to pay your rent and take care of your home properly? I don't think so, buddy.
praying somebody will help me out with that on the wish on the Amazon wish list. I could put I guess I could put that link in the comments of this after. If someone could get us like what? candy for Halloween. Halloween I'd, candy? Yeah. I could put that on the list. That would be What are you twelve? Uh, could somebody put candy? Could you send me some candy? The last thing you need is candy on Halloween. You're forty years old. Get over it. You don't need any candy. Okay there, liabetes. Wonderful. All right, so... Or groceries. We need that, too. So in case you missed it, Jason needs a computer and a microphone, guys. If you could help him out with the Amazon wish list and get him a computer and a, and a microphone and groceries and some Halloween candy for Miss uh, the Skinny Legend over there. You have to be Delulu. People do not like you that much. I'm so sorry. Yeah. What, what I'm don't. trying to work on that. Well, I'm just saying, what don't we need? It's like, this is just, so I, much. I, I can't, my head spins. It, may, it really is overwhelming. I feel like I need somebody's help to guide me through the next steps. I do. I, I really feel like I need help. Me too, because I'm like, you know who can help you? Unemployer. That would, that, that would be a huge help because then you wouldn't have to e-bag for all these things. You could just buy them yourselves. There's your help, Jason. It's pathetic. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I need help. I need help living a normal, everyday adult life. Imagine. Imagine how pathetic. It's really, it's, 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 it's like in vertigo inducing to think about this shit. CVS is pulling all cold and cough medications because of the stupid CDC why not sell stuff to subs? I, 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 we don't have anything left, bro. Or sis. Okay? Crafty Cup of 21. That literally, we have pretty much nothing. That's because you had to leave it all in Colorado, remember? You only had three days to get out and couldn't fit it all. I got a few decks of magic cards that I kept. This is my favorite deck I ever made, the Eldrazi deck. Okay? El, El, Eldrazi. <laughs> okay, that's my favorite magic deck. I, I got know. my shame, my old. Look how old this is. I know it's this old. Is how freaking used it is. The yeah. conspiracy ballot. It's still, it's still great though. It's still, it looks. I, cool. I love this shit. Yeah. Anyway, there you go. See, what is it? The CDC saying that cough medications don't really work, so they're pulling them off the market. Anything with like the Benadryl, uh, phen phenylalanine, you know, phenylalanine. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's equal. Neutral sweet. Phenylalanine. Yeah, they're put they're pulling it off. Like I'm like fuck that man. I want my freaking Benadryl. Yeah. Of course you do, Drughead. Um, the uh, Benadryl that was in the cough medicine was doing the same as a placebo effect. Just buy um, Benadryl then, Dopey. <laughs> that, everybody does. It's very good sleep aid. Oh, I love Benadryl. Uh, yeah, it would have been great to have the PS5. We, gave the, we had to give the PS5 for rent. Dog shit. Whatever. We don't even have a TV to use it with anyway. No. Well, we got a cap card, though. We yeah. do have a cap card. We can play it on the computer. Yeah. I got my Wii, or my Switch still. You got your Switch, which, thank God. Yeah. I can play my Animal Crossing and my Stardew Valley. Yeah. But see, I only... Wow. What a life you guys have. Imagine this being your every day. Just this. Do that to relax. I know. You should stream it. I should. Because it's crime and games, you know? Mm-hmm. We got Animal Crossing, and then on the other end of the spectrum, you got... What was the guy kid's name? Steven? Steven. Steven? We gotta review that. Look at what I can do, Steven. He's going back to his chair. Come on, <laughs> come on, Steven. Steven, you know this is wrong, Steven. That's great. We have to review that, because it's classic. And the pig lady again. And the pig lady, yeah. Yeah, we gotta do that again. Absolutely. Shannon, you are the pig woman. Congratulations. So, this will just be a... I don't know if I'm gonna come back. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. But I really wanted... I, I, if we, I, we could also, by the way... Yeah. Um... Do the videos that are on like Blue Watch? Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah, we could go through a lot of them. There's so many of them; it's like insane. So we do old ones we've seen before and new ones, whatever. Funny how you two don't have money for groceries, but you sure do have money for cigarettes and soda. Yeah, and we're not we're not gonna be haters like you guys. You 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 parasocial maggoty. I don't understand why watermelon eaters. Yeah, Shani, I'm. Shani learned a new word. It's parasocial. Unfortunately, she doesn't know how to use it properly. How embarrassing. Miss your cooking fit. See, there's another one. I know. They love you, the cooking. I have some ideas. We're in a transition period right now. And we, yeah. We love you, Rebel. Thank you. I appreciate that. I really love you, too. I try. I, but how I, about we love you, Shani? What's the <laughs> <laughs> this nobody loves you, Shani. <laughs>
And nobody can stand you. Love out there for Shanny. Come on. I, I mean, I think that's understood. I need that, too. But I think that's understood. You, like they say, rabbit, they mean you too. I've been beaten up by these people for ten freaking years. Ten years. No, you chose to stay online, and you chose to act like an absolute behem, and that's why you have the problems online that you have. That's why nobody loves Shanny. I don't need that anymore. We need the rev. Okay. Well, you we need the Shanny, too, because... Stacey Lockwood said we love you, Shanny. Thank you. See? There's love. There you go. See? Love wins. All you haters, you don't win. You're, 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 you're about to lose, you know? You're about to see, like... <laughs> the worst and Re like, forget Re your karma reverend dude is a character and if you i saw one of my friends make a very good point the other day how do you believe in karma which is hindu and then believe in christianity at the same time make that make sense he, he might come back ba ba banksy the bug thank you i appreciate the love you know that's sweet amazon wish list for cooking vid, vid ingredients okay we could do that we could definitely do that Amazon's awesome. You can get your groceries. We love you, Shani, more more than Delta Eight. Well, that's pretty. That's a lot of love. It's a lot of love. <laughs> if I could rock, if I could get rock that cheap computer and the ch it's cheap ass microphone, I'll start doing it again. And, and spirit led. Okay, that's that's the key here. And I do think he's starting to make connections again and show me some shit. I want to go to Thailand and go to their weed places and try them out. Wow, for someone who is in so much agonizing pain all the time, you certainly want to go a lot of places. We're going to Israel, we're going to Thailand to go to weed shops. We have got a lot of plans, no money. I thought you were in so much pain, Shannon, that you couldn't even lift your head. I don't I don't blame you. Dude, it'd be so awesome. Yeah, it'd be fun. It would be. I'm feeling but like I, gabapentin in the um Yeah, I know. Muscle relaxant, so I <laughs> That's cool, but I, I just... I'm just starting to feel the gabapentin in the muscle relaxers, so you know. So you're high. What a shocker. That never happens. I just probably have to apologize Ooh. once more. <clears throat> because it did seem like, in that video, uh, 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 with that that individual on Instagram that was going to send me cigarette money, and they, they didn't... They didn't, know. It seemed... Huh? And then we got an email today that said, do you want, do you want, mm -hmm. do you want some money? And I'm like... Oh, right. That's we a blessing. Some, we can get some money and, 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 and get some food. And, and you know what happened? Nothing. Yeah. But see, Jesus will show you the way, Rev. Thank you. Yeah, I know he will. Uh, he's definitely doing that. He's going to do it perfectly. If no one owes either of you shit. Not Teddy Bear, not anyone else that said that they were going to give you money. Get money by earning it. Stop making it other people's problems that you two are losers. Felt bad for that girl. Yeah, it, I, it, look, I was not targeting her at all. And I know it seemed that way, and I apologize to her too, because it, it seemed that way. Oh, I'm going to block you, because uh, some blue-haired chick came on the, the channel, and she was saying, I, it, it's disgusting that you block people that don't give you money. And it seemed like that's what it was, and that really isn't what it was, okay? I'm sick of people that, that it's like, if you don't know for sure that you can do it, it's fine. Don't, just, just forget about it. But it's like you lead a person on all day, and then it, I just got pissed off at it. Because it's happened a few times before. And it's ungrateful and stupid of me to feel that way, because it's like every blessing is a blessing, and if it can happen, oh, no big deal. That's how I should feel about it. Exactly. You should be grateful there's even anyone that will speak to you, let alone give you anything. You should be grateful anyone looks in your direction. So I apologize for that. That was bullshit. That was shitty. Right? That, yeah, yeah. That was shitty, and it does seem like always oh, blocking people that don't give money. I would love some yeah. Taco Bell, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. To... to <laughs> she would like some Taco Bell, guys. Quick, get on that. Make sure you throw in a Baja Blast for Rev. The individual, I really do apologize. I haven't given money and I'm not blocked. Yeah, that's, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. But I apologize to that individual because that's not right. I apologize to no one for I've done nothing. <laughs> that's great. You know, that you're clean. You're no, you've done nothing. You just allowed some dork to freaking hurt your kid, get your kids taken away, and... uh lied about having breast cancer, but you're clean. What happened to the breast cancer, Shani? We don't have that anymore. They didn't find anything this time. They found something, baby. <laughs> what happened? It's gone. It disappeared. Poof. Magic. Amazing. You're clean and, and, and you're clean. Uh, Can I'm... you think of ways to make your own money, Rev? Yeah, absolutely. We have been. Yeah, I got I, I got plenty of ideas that go around in my head, like like going back to school doing graphic design. I, I would love to be in graphic design and, and layout because that's where my talent is, laying out graphics. And I'd like to go back to school and finish my psychology degree. Yeah, there you go, Shani. With a minor of anthropology mm -hmm. 
or Shani, you'll never you'll never finish any degree of any time any kind with a minor in anthropology. You're 40 years old. Get a real job. Sociology, whatever. Well, sociology would include anthropology. Yeah. Sociology. Yeah, of course. Minor in that. Absolutely. I love sociology classes. Yeah, and, and, and food anthropology. Oh, I love food anthropology. It's uh, like so amazing. Um, what is his name? Dylan something. Uh, Dylan McGrady. No. No. Oh. You're talking about the Queen guy? Yeah, the Queen That's guy. Darren McGrady. Darren McGrady. Darren he's, McGrady. He's, oh my God. He's, I love his channel. Oh my God. It's like a PBS show. I love Queen Elizabeth and I don't give a fuck what people have to say about that. And I love Chantel and I don't give a fuck what people have to say about that. I don't care if someone did something wrong. You do something wrong too. You act like an asshole. How far did you get with your degree, June? Asked June. Uh, two and a half years of college, but really I have six years of college because I kept changing. What I you liar. You don't have six years of college. Your parents said you never went to school, you barely did anything, and you never worked. I wanted to do, like, I have like three semesters in the nursing, and then I changed from that went into computer programming, got my A-plus certification, and then I changed from that because the industry was extremely sexist at the time. Mm. Oh yeah, I'm sure that's it. You went and got your degree in graphic design, but it was too sexist for you to get a job. How convenient. And I didn't like that. So, okay, here's a, a point in the chat. AI has made, made graphic design redundant, Rev. So does that mean all graphic designers are out of a job? I don't think so. What if he integrates AI with his graphic design, eh? I might have to learn AI stuff, yeah. Well, you probably will if you go to a a trade school. Okay. That's cool. Fine. I'll get involved with graphic design AI. Fine. I, I that's my talent. And my, my computer teacher told me, he said, your, your assignment was so impeccably perfectly done, Jason. He's like, this is what you should be doing. It's his passion. Lay out, out in graphic design. That's it. Great. You really need to try strawberry Cheyenne. Are they good? I don't, I don't know if they have strawberry ones. I'll look for the strawberry. strawberry. I'll, I'll get one pack of them. We try them. Strawberry Cheyenne. No, they don't have them in the state of Pennsylvania. They don't get flavored cigarettes. That's wrong. They have vanilla. They have. I, I know, right? And there's more stupid people trying to ban that too because they they are butt hurt that teenagers like to freaking smoke. <laughs> yeah, they do. And as a mother of a teenager, I don't want my son smoking or having access to that garbage. So, speaking as a real parent, I'm glad that they're they're not allowing that. Sorry, you two might need to get the hell over it. <laughs> Sorry, I went on. I, I ran on a, a, a ray up there. I apologize. I appreciate the ideas, uh, Crafty Cup of Twenty One. I, I appreciate those ideas, but like, I never landscaped or nothing. I need. Oh some, no! I need some. Oh, shit. Go to the neighbors and ask if you can rake their leaves for ten bucks a bag. My fourteen-year-old son does that. That's how he gets extra money on top of his allowance. He has more money than you two do. Isn't that sad? My son's going to be a success when he grows up, thanks to me teaching him how to be. You would not be happy landscaping. Grape is good, but strawberry. Okay, awesome. Thank you. I Who gives a shit if he likes landscaping or not? You two just said you have no groceries, no nothing. Nada. Who cares if he likes it? We all go to jobs we don't like sometimes. Toughen the fuck up. Get over it. You need shit, you want everyone to give you shit, but you're not willing to work for a goddamn thing. Well, you wouldn't like landscaping. Would you like the paycheck afterwards? I appreciate all of the encouragement on employment. I do actually appreciate that. Okay? I, I'm, I'm like a fish out of water in this situation, so I really, it's it's rough for me, man. And, and I tried to make that clear, but it, it, that was whatever. It's okay, baby. I'll, I'll be there for you. I'm a slow blooming flower and like failure to launch. You ever see that movie with Matthew McConaughey? Mm -hmm. failure, failure to launch. I'm kind of like him in that. Like, I, I was privileged, and I didn't have to do a fight. Like the dude, you know, employment. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? It's I'm kind of like that, because I was just privileged, you know? So I'm... But you're no longer privileged. You're now destitute. So where are the excuses going to go now? A fish out of water, and I really got to get my sea legs, and I'm trying to understand how to do that. That's the truth. I'm at work now, and it stinks. I'm sorry, Miss Shanner TV. <laughs> That's most of America, right? It, I, that's insane. You're just debt slaves. Uh-huh. Until we get the Federal Reserve out of the, the country, you're a debt slave. Yep. I think you'd be great in graphic design. I Well, I'll tell you, reality check. Uh, I'd like to be a podcaster and actually do mm -hmm, my passion. Mm -hmm. My real passion. My real passion is probably radio and broadcasting. Yeah. Basically, this what we're doing now. Yeah. This is our passion. Yeah. This is not broadcasting, and we don't care about what your passion is because your passion doesn't pay. 
church community and give you ideas. I, yeah, I church. We need a church. I live in PA. They have, they have strawberry, but I cross state line and go to uh, MD. Shit. I want to go home. Yeah, but it's OB. it's it's illegal <laughs> to do that. So no no go for me. Listen to Miss Law Abiding Citizen over here. That's a no go for me. Are you kidding me? You won't bring a flavored cigarette over state lines. <laughs> You've done way worse. PA puts cat litter in the filter. Oh, give me a break. Okay, we're done. Stop being dumb. I could have got in at Bitcoin when it was seven dollars a Bitcoin. I don't want to talk about Bitcoin, but it's it crashed. If that was true, the federal federal um, oh, fuck the FDA, if they would go and notice there's cat litter in that and uh, ban it. I would think so. So I would think so. That, that's so dumb. Anyway, I guess this video turned into not. I was going to just say the, say it's a goodbye video because I was going to preach in it too. But I, maybe this isn't goodbye. Maybe this is Rev gets his shit together, gets a fucking nice paying job, whatever that's going to be. I have applied at a few different places, but, but it's like work history. <laughs> work history? What? They see that and they're like, you know, you have no work history. Yeah, that's. Accurate. But you do in other ways. Yeah, in other ways, but it's like it's not nine to five. They want to see. Okay, he worked at Burger King. Okay, then he worked at a you know giant food market. It, a history of employment, and there is none. I am so sick of this excuse. There are plenty of places that will take you if you don't have job history, if you explain why you don't have job history. This is just an excuse. Except for my own business is, because I have a publication company. Too. Well, then put that down. That's a job. That's what that's what my therapist was, and I were working on. We're going to finish that next week. That's oh, good. What, that's what I'll make the, the mission next week is to finish that. Check your package. Look for heavy weight on the package. I would never lie to you, Shani. Okay. Huh? Cat litter must be harmless because if, uh, if this is a PA cigarette, these are the best, man. You guys, if you ever see these and you're a smoker, try them. They're a buck seventy something a pack. They're bigger than hundreds. They're like a French cigarette, but it's cigars crisscross. Amazing. So these are awesome. The best, actually. He recommends. Go fund me to your car on the road and be an Amazon delivery driver. Yeah, that, but hey, you got good ideas, okay? Like, that's not, no lie. You got good ideas. I would probably be most comfortable Amazon job at customer service. I think I'd be good at that because I can treat people well over the phone. I'm pretty good at that. And I think... <laughs> I fully agree with that. I think that that's a great idea, and I think Amazon has tons of jobs like that that you could do. That's an actually good idea. I, I do need a car, though, because the bus routes are dog shit, okay? I've looked into the bus routes, and it's it's they don't go to the places of that what I would be interested in working. They just don't even go near them. I have to. I would have to walk that and walk that, and I don't know how many. How, do I have to get up at 5 to 4 o'clock in the morning to get to work? I Like, that's insane. No, it's not insane. It's what people do to survive. Okay, I had I I worked an hour away from where I lived when we were in the army. I drove an hour there and an hour back every day. I had a little baby in daycare. I made it work. And on the weekends, I volunteered for a shelter. So, um it's definitely possible. I've done way more with way less than what you have. So there's no excuse at all. Waking up at 5 a.m. for work? Yep, done it. Done it. And uh, that's how I made my, that's how I paid my bills. So kiss my ass with that pathetic excuse. You're so, so entitled. It's unreal. That would get you so angry. I, it's that, see? Yeah. And I don't want to live like You're that, You're grumpy man. boys in the morning sometimes. I like the night, though. I'm kind of a night owl. Hyper snicks. I'm kind of a night owl. I always was. So and am I. I could go back to that, and that's why I'm making my money. You know, that's cool. I would love to customer service, though. I heard that EBT requires a word. No, it's not. It's not. I think we are exempt from that because of our mental health. Like CPS knows that we're, we got mental issues, both of us. Neither of you have a diagnosis, especially you, Jason, because we saw you all admit that Shani diagnosed you. You never got a real diagnosis from a doctor. Shani diagnosed you. So you would need proof of that diagnosis in order for it to do anything. Shani diagnosing you is not, uh, not it. Sorry. So you're exempt if you have mental, you, you are, di I am diagnosed schizoaffective and bipolar, okay? Di if you were diagnosed with that, you would be medicated for those things. Shani diagnosed you, liar. Diagnosed. I should have disability, no problem. And I'm diagnosed borderline personality disorder. Not right, which is a listed one on disability too. Yep. The then why is it that both of you applied for disability and neither one of you got it? Looks like you're not disabled in any way. The government doesn't care. They fucking flip you off. They don't give a shit. We don't care about the mentally ill. There's a stigma. Any plans for the night? We're, we're just good. We, we love watching videos, man. We've been watching foodie videos. We've been watching food. We binge, we're binge watching. Uh, we binge watched Salat and, and Chantal's uh, uh, 
Uh, <laughs> Kylan's <laughs> vacation. Christ, thank you. <laughs> Please cut that and repeat that over and over again. Scott, the not, not, not <laughs> I sound like Billy Bibbit. Brad Dourif. It's okay, we're getting old. Brad Dourif in, in, in uh, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. I, 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 holy shit. Look, I've been terrible memory problems. I'm having issues. Yeah, you're having issues. I'm having issues. Fuck the ableists. Yeah, that's right. Like this, You're pieces of shit. That's disgusting, Joe Biden. When you make fun of people or you invalidate what health crisis or, you know, diagnose they have. You're a piece of shit for that. That, that, ableism is, is evil. It is. Ableism is, is, I think, probably the most evil ideology you can have along with, with anti-Semitism, Nazism, that type of shit. Yeah. You're it's kicking uh, someone racism, who racism. has a weakness and, and, and tr trying to feel powerful for it. But here's the thing. This is why you're so fucking weak, is you need a whole group of people to back you up and validate you so you can do horrible things to people. You're That's a piece an, of shit. Isn't that crazy? Kristen uh, Dow yeah. says she just saw the original Birds movie. Do you like that? I do. Yeah, Hitchcock. I, I love Hitchcock, yeah. I, I loved the Hitchcock show that was on Nick Nick at Night, uh, Alfred Hitchcock Theater, I think it was called, or something. And the state lines thing, you can buy a carton and pass lines, they limit it, and my boyfriend is a cop and he just told me, whatever. I, it's Who's doing that right now to you? What? I'm not name dropping and giving them clout. Fuck them. <laughs> no one wants anything that you have and you're so vile with that disgusting witch laugh smoke another carton of those uh whatever they are you sound like you've been smoking 80 a day i'm reminding myself of like a cross of, of like the guy from monster Mag magnet and like cory taylor really if they had a son together who looked like me with the shades on and goatee you're biting shades or a little bit. I'm looking like right now a little bit like the guy from Avenged Sevenfold. Okay. I like them. <laughs> you look like a little weasel with sunglasses on. That's what you look like, okay, Sevenfold? They're pretty good. I have one of their albums. I don't have any of the albums, but I do Their enjoy... song, Jesus Christ. Their, oh, my God. Their song that's on, I think it's Guitar Hero 3. I don't think I ever beat it. Uh. I, that's, that's one that I couldn't get the, the rhythm of it. It was insane. You said rhythm. <laughs> oh my god, and the new Beavis and Buttheads. <laughs> Stop bitching, okay. No, fuck you, don't tell people what to do. I mean, this is just at this point, talking to chat and, and hanging out and ranting. Yeah. Heath Ledger, dude. Oh, wow, that's a huge compliment. Stop telling the truth about what happens. Stop telling the truth. We need to go and have our stupid fucking lies. Banksy the Bug gave me a huge compliment, said uh, Heath Ledger. That's a massive compliment. Ooh. Yeah, Shani's really, she likes him. Yeah. Heath Ledger was an extremely handsome, extremely talented actor who unfortunately went to a very dark place. There is no co comparing you to him. McCain Dillon. McCants Dillon, sorry. <laughs> says she, they missed the cooking videos too. That's, That's there's awesome. many votes for the cooking videos. You know what? What? My favorite Heath Ledger movie is 10 Things I Hate About You. Yeah, that's my. I think that's my favorite Heath Ledger movie too. Yeah, and then second to that is... Um, oh, my, mine's Dark Knight, definitely. Se oh, second. Yeah, me. Dark Knight, and then it, it'll be... Um, oh, fuck, what is that movie? I always watch it. It's a medieval one. His name is William. Knight. First Knight. What, so. No, no, that's that's with fucking... Um, God, my... Chris, Kristen Dow says, Shani, you're awesome singing Fleetwood Mac. That's true. Yeah, yeah, You're really, really, really good at singing Fleetwood Mac. And on that same subject, I am extremely proud. I'm not, I, like, I, seriously, I'm not this type of, like, like, egomaniac weirdo. But if you look up, just look up Jason Avocado sings, uh, I Can't Help Falling in Love with You by Elvis, okay? I really think I hit that fucking song. I, Buckle up, kids. This is about to get good. I think, I, I think that recording of that song is better than his 1963 or whatever it was comeback. I sang it better than him, I think. Blasphemy. I'm not, look, I'm, I'm not an egomaniac, but it's on YouTube because I have a channel on there that was just for music. It's called Eager Beaver Pleaser. I, I, <laughs> I, I called it that because I wanted it to, I wanted nobody to find me. But of course, because I'm, I'm just obsessed with, 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 with the interaction and stuff like that. I, I put up my fucking smule. I, I like recorded my smules and put them on there. Listen to that one. I really think I hit that shit, man. You could probably. Imagine being so deluded that you believe that you sang an Elvis Presley song better than Elvis Presley did in 1963. Are you fucking kidding? Maybe Heath right now, Rev, you're on fire. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. God bless him. I... He didn't start the fire. Do, 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 do we meet, do we miss Heath Ledger in here? I do. Shani, do you, do you miss Heath Ledger? Of course I do. Yeah, I miss him. He would have been amazing. Stop it, Red. El Elvis is a legend. You're right. Okay, I'm not saying. Okay, I won't say I did it better than I. Well, okay, <laughs> wait. 
go listen to the Eager Beaver Pleaser channel. Uh, can't help falling in love with you. My 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 rendition of it, and I kind of I'm jokey about it because Elvis loved peanut butter and jelly, uh, uh, ba and bacon and banana sandwiches fried. I, I kind of jokey with that, but really listen to my voice when I sing the song, and then go listen to the Elvis version, uh, 1963 comeback where he's on stage. Okay, in the leather, he looks amazing. He he came back and he was he was looking. It wasn't the fat Elvis. No, was he was trim as fuck. He looked oh, really oh, fit. Okay, and he was in a le all leather leather pants, leather jacket. He looked amazing. Okay, listen to him singing it. I could we do this sometime. Yeah. I objectively think I sang it better than him. And was I impersonating him? Yes. Oh, yes, Jason. You sang it so much better than Elvis Presley himself. And I am actually Adele. I know you didn't know that, but I am Adele. I am Adele's backup singer. Okay. But I think my live impersonation was better than him singing it in 62 himself. Or whatever year that was. Sorry. Sorry I'm late. Hey, Crypto Not. My grandmother and mom died the same day as Elvis while take, talking about Elvis passing away. What? That's fucking cool. Wow, that's really crazy. I've li I've listened to Shani. She is good too. Shani's an amazing freaking singer. <laughs> she is absolutely incredible. Crypto Crypto Knot is correct. Yeah, he lives with me, so he sees me making up tunes and singing. No, this is incredible. We go out. Rev, you and Shani should do karaoke night. Subs will pay per song request. Wow, that's an awesome idea. <gasps> Look at that skirt. And then we record it. Isn't that beautiful? That's hot, man. I love corset type shit. Oh, I'd wear that with some. Um, I love corset stuff. Some fishnets. With oh uh, yeah, corsets and fishnets. That's yeah, and, and, <laughs> and combat boots. Oh what? Yeah. Damn. Can anyone imagine Shani in a corset, fishnet stockings, and combat boots? Oh, what a vision. <laughs> I would pay good money to see that, kids. That's it. You'll be up my skirt. Quick. But anyway, okay, this is an ego. Maybe it's, maybe it is ego, but uh, whatever. I, it's just objective. I think I did better. But, 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 but you can also consider the... How can you sing a song better than the original person who sang the song? You do not. The fact that it was a live performance of multiple songs, and he, he just wanted to do a rendition for that. No lie, I listen to you guys when I'm welding at work. Wish you had longer streams. I will re-listen to this one tomorrow morning. Hey, that's thanks, man. God bless you, man. I, whatever you believe, crypto not thirty two. Very cool. I want to. I would love to get into cryptos if I had some liquid cash. Oh, I, I would try and play that. You should. I would try because there are opportunities out there where it, dip, it dips. You buy it, then when it what? You have to be in on it though. You gotta know the information. God bless you, Crypto Not. Thank you. He just blessed you. Thank and you. me. Awesome. So all right, this ain't a goodbye video. This is uh, Rev. Get his shit together and get a computer, and we'll see what happens. You don't need. Oh, trust me. We knew this wasn't a goodbye video. We knew this was a grift video. Hey, Cash, I can show you how. Really. DM me. I, I'll keep I'll keep Instagram on here for you, and if you could teach me some stuff, I will follow you as a student. Dude, you're gonna farm crypto? I don't know. Maybe. Are you talking about crypto farming? Crypto nut? Yeah, I'm with you, dude. I sent you several. Met you have. Look, I'm really sorry. Okay, I will go. I will go, and I will check that out. Absolutely. First thing tomorrow, I'm gonna I'm gonna dig into that, bro. Seriously, no trading. It's but that sounds like free money to me. How how do you get free money? I have a Robinhood account. And I can give you the at if you could hook me up with, so, with I some. I mean, you can make money on something the to start with. I know that. I'm going to really read your messages, okay? And I apologize. A lot of stuff I don't look at, but like cool people like you slip through the cracks, and that's the trolls getting what they want. And and screw that shit. I'm going to look at your messages, and I apologize, okay? And I'm always apologizing, but you, you gotta when you screw up, you gotta apologize. It's just it's proper. It's nice, you know. We want to be cool together. These two are so desperate to have any fr friends whatsoever. It's actually sad. All right, you want to say anything else? Uh, are you cool? I'm cool. You're cool. All right. Political beatdown. <laughs> Talk a little bit about Trumpy. No worries, bro. Glad I caught the live. I'm glad you did too. Knit, knit evil is a hater of you. I never heard that name before. Knit, knit evil. N, -N I T E V one. I have no idea. Never heard of them. There's so many haters. I'm not going to keep track of them. I can't add people to my live that I don't know. I apologize. Okay, you withdrew it. God bless you. All right. Rev, get his shit together. Absolutely. Got Jesus is king. So, good morning, my lovies. Happy Monday. Isn't it so great when it's Monday and we all have to go back to work? But not these two, but, you know, the rest of us. Um, I hope you all are having an amazing morning. Um, this was hysterical only because this was Rev's get his shit together. If you could please send him a computer and a microphone. <laughs> I can't even say it. 
and groceries and throw in some Halloween candy for Shani because that's what she needs is candy. Um, I just find these two so entitled that they really believe that they are important enough for people to buy them a computer and a, and a microphone and that that's what they're going to get off the ground with and start actually working and having careers. Bullshit. They are the worst. They are the absolute worst. She makes me sick with her side comments and uh, he is just a fool. And that's today's video. <laughs> I know it's not much, but uh, that's as much as we can grab from what we just watched. Absolute nonsense, grifting, e-begging. Uh, talking about how you're going to be broadcasters, you're both going back to college. When are all these things going to happen? When? Just wondering. But for the rest of my lovies, um, I hope you have a wonderful day. Please hit the like on the way in or the way out, and I will be back very soon. And I love you guys, and I hope you guys have a great, great day. Bye, guys. And there's nobody out there like it like I am There's nobody out there that can say my name